What's up, gamers? What's, what's up? How's it going? Welcome back to Minecraft and welcome to a brand new village. I completely forgot that these changed. Oh, look how cool they are. We've got aminals, we've got trees, we've got market stalls, and the most important, bell, which you can make music with. Speaking of music, that's what we're going to be making today. So I kind of did this in Fortnite before I made a song. You guys loved it. So I thought I'd go back into the OG music making software, and that's Minecraft. This is pretty much what Fortnite copied anyway, is the note block system inside Minecraft. But now they've added this many different sounds to the game. They used to only be like four or five, and now there's like 12. It's crazy. So let's listen to them all. Let's see double bass. I think that's one of the classic sounds. Then we've also got snare drum. Not bad, different pitches as well. Clicks. Bass drum. Yeah, that has different pitches too. That's interesting. Bell. Okay, a little bit of a nicer bell than the one the, uh, the villagers have. Flute. <laughs> that's kind of cool. Chime. Nice guitar. Ooh. That one's actually really realistic. Cool. Xylophone. Metal xylophone. Yeah, they sound really different. Cowbell. <laughs> didgeridoo. That, that don't sound like a didgeridoo to me. That sounds weird. Have I done this wrong? Hold on a second. Pumpkin. Let's try this instead. Yeah, that's better. That's a much better sound. Bits. Oh, this is my favorite one. Oh, this one's good. I might use this one. Banjo. Pling. And finally, harp, which is just any block underneath. So yeah, if you didn't know, every single note block has 24 pitches, which is two octaves. If you know your music theory, if you don't, don't worry. It just means you can go from C to C twice. And then you change the sound by using a different block underneath. So for example, for the snare drum, you have to put sand underneath. And then for the click, you put glass underneath. Bell, you put gold. And then the only one that can have anything apart from these blocks is the ARP which just sounds like this. So what's quite difficult in Minecraft to make songs is the timing aspect. You could do it in Fortnite where you just have the pressure plates and you walk along, but the pressure plates have sound, so it kind of detracts from the music. So instead, you have to set up a system like this. And I know, I'm going crazy with redstone in this one. This is, well, this is me going crazy with redstone. Don't judge me, just listen, you ready? That's, a, that's about as good as it gets from me. That's a simple uh, a simple kick snare line. Uh, let's add some hi-hats. What can we use, a click? Let's do a click. So we need, oh, how do we put, how do we put redstone on glass? Can we do that now? Oh, we can, okay, cool. So let's make this all the way along here and then we can add some note blocks. And I think I'm just gonna do it every single beat. So it's like, boom, boom, boom. Does that even make sense? So if we put this here, this, and then just this the whole way, is that gonna work? There's only one way to find out. Let's put repeaters every single time. And you can also make the repeaters longer depending on how often you want the sound to play. But let's listen, see what happens. Okay, that's way too fast. <laughs> let's extend these all the way back. So this should make it the same kind of speed, I think. Yes, that actually worked, dude. Okay, let me listen again. Oh, nice. What else should I do to play to the beautiful villagers of Minecraft? Um, I think I'm gonna add, I'm gonna try and add uh, a line to go over the top. And I like the bit, but I think I'm gonna use the didgeridoo, you know, because, wait, can you put redstone on didgeridoo? You can, I mean, pumpkin. You know what I mean? Let's make a line of these pumpkin boys. And then I just need to make, uh, I don't really know. Let's just put, I'm just gonna put note blocks and repeaters just everywhere and then kind of try and make it from there. I've never done this before and I suck with redstone. So let's just see what comes out, shall we? Redstone along here. We put this here and go. Oh, okay. So you can't put them next to each other. <laughs> Oopsie. Let's see this instead. Here we go. That sounds awful. We need to bring these up loads of pitches. So they have different colors as well. The red means they're in the higher octave. The green means they're lower to the bottom. And then it goes back to the beginning when it hits purple. So let's press it again. 
that, 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 that. Um, let's just try and extend some of these. Leave that one like that. This. Okay, let's see what this sounds like. It's probably gonna sound horrible. But it's kind of along the same lines. You know what? It's not too bad, but if you want to repeat anything, it gets really long. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna change this sound because I don't like it. What should we have instead? Pling's okay. Do you do too low? Guitar. Let's do guitar. We need wool. We can have any color wool. But let's just replace this under here, and this should change it. It doesn't need to be on the redstone as well. And also stay tuned, because I've got a cheat way to make this a lot quicker, so we can actually make a full song and then import it into Minecraft, which is pretty cool. Let's listen to this. <laughs> that sounds awful. There we go. That's all I can make in Minecraft. Uh, the lead line is terrible. But let me show you a little cheat that you can use to be able to make it in an external program using all your note block sounds. Because, of course, you're going to have to keep on hitting these like 14 times if you want the right note and then place them all and then time them all up. It's crazy, but here's a cheat code. Here it is. It's called the Minecraft Note Block Studio. And it allows you to use every single sound. So you can just click these up here to make all the sounds, which is cool. And then you can use the piano down here, which has the two octaves that you can use. And then you can just start inputting notes, which is awesome. You can also play it too. <laughs> and then at the top right, it tells you if it's compatible. This is currently too fast, but you can make something like this if you really wanted to. That's just very, very simple. But let's start again. Let's make a new one. And then what you can do is after you've created this, you can take it into Minecraft and it will build all the note blocks for you. It's kind of crazy. So let's get creating, shall we? So I'm going to use that as my base. And then I think you can copy and paste here as well. There are tools to do it, but I just need to learn it. Oh, wait. Yes. Okay, that's much quicker. Okay, sounds a little bit weird. It sounds a little bit off time, but it's all in time on the program. So let's listen in. Yeah, there we go. We just need to shake it up a little bit. Yeah, much better. Right, this is the sound I'm going to use to do the melody, which would be way better in this program. But first, we need a bass. And obviously, you can't do, like, held notes because they're all just, like, they're all the same length. Okay, this is what I got us so far. I kind of added a little bit at the beginning. I think the program plays it back in a weird way, but, um, hear it out anyway. And then it will just repeat. So now we need... my sound. I like that. <laughs> okay, I think I've got it. I haven't tested this last bit out, but it should be good. <laughs> okay, there's one bit that's off. I think I've got it. This is it. Yeah, there we go. Okay, cool. Remember, this is all going to be imported into Minecraft afterwards. So definitely stay tuned for that. What else can we use? This? No, that sounds trash. Get out. Oh, I missed that one. Hold on. Nice. Okay. Do you reckon we could add maybe an octave? There's only two octaves to work with in Minecraft, so it's kind of difficult. Okay, octaves don't really work. No, I like it normally. I added a ding. Yeah. Okay, that sounds wicked. Okay. This is taking me 30 minutes. This is... <laughs> so I should be able to copy and paste this. Copy. Uh, paste. Okay, I don't think that worked. No, that definitely didn't work. Undo. Paste. Why is this not doing it? Oh, oh, found a hack. One sec. Should repeat now. Yes.
It worked. So let's try and take this into Minecraft. So I should be able to save song. Ooh. And then export as data pack. Music without no blocks. Minecraft 1.3. Oh, geez, this is gonna be weird. I don't know if this is gonna work. Let's just export and see what happens. Okay, I think I've added it, but I don't know how I get it into the world then. Okay, so what I've done now, I just need to go ahead and do forward slash function vid song. Oh, here it is, here it is, here it is, look. Play. <laughs> Does it just repeat? That's sick! Okay, I want it imported in note blocks though. I think I need to do it as a schematic, which requires world edit. Okay, this is gonna be long. One sec. So what you're seeing right now is something called MC Edit, which I used a long time ago in Minecraft, where you can pop things in. So hopefully, I can import it using this. Let's see what happens. Import. Oh, 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 it might have worked. It might have worked, but I can't see anything. Oh, here we go. It did work, but there's also these question mark blocks, which I'm a little bit worried about. But this is my song. All in converted into note blocks. That's crazy. I wonder if this is going to break, though. It could potentially break, but we'll see. Confirm. And then we should do uh, save. Save world. And that should work. Is it there? Oh, I'm inside it. Okay, this is bad. This is real bad news. There we go. Fix this. Boom. There it is. My song inside Minecraft. Let's see if it works, though. It could go very, very wrong. The song generated by the Minecraft Note Block Studio. Yes, I don't think that sounds the same though. If I, this is in the old version of Minecraft. Let me reload it and see what happens. Is it gonna work? Come on, loading screen. Pull through for me, please. Oh, it worked. Okay, we've got it in the new Minecraft. I don't know if this is gonna work though. Let's find out. Kinda. It kinda worked. Let me get rid of the slimes, which I've now done. Let's fly around a little bit. No villages. Oh, there's a village. Beautiful. Let's play it again. It works! It, the sound, like, the tempo is a little bit off, but it actually works. The donkey likes it. That's so clever. Oh, it's working now. Because it was loading in the world, it was uh, jittering, but now it's the perfect tempo. It's cool how they make this. There's no way I'd be able to recreate it. It's so clever though. And just like that, it's not as easy as Fortnite, but you can make your very own song inside Minecraft. It's crazy. I love the new sounds. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Guys, let me know what you think. This was a process. This took me about an hour, I think. Yeah, just under an hour to create and put into my world as well. So, hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like. It would be greatly appreciated. Let me know what other cool things we can do in Minecraft. Now, it's much better. Like, the, the 1.14 update is so good. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like. Subscribe if you're brand new for more Minecraft and more random stuff every single day. And also, if you're in the UK, please come to my tour. I've got a brand new show taking it around the UK for four special shows. It's brand new. It's awesome. It'll be the best YouTuber show you've ever seen. Link is in the description to get tickets. Apart from that, guys, I'll see you next time. Goodbye. Posters, tie swing, wagon, candle, canvas, sofa, fork, rubber band.